Let's see what is the best CPU to pair with the RTX 4070 if you're building an Intel PC. While the Intel Core i5-13600KF isn't the latest mid-range Intel chip, it's still arguably the best value option for gamers looking to pair it with an RTX 4070. Intel's 14th generation of processors are out, but they don't show an improvement in performance enough to warrant an upgrade for gamers. This makes the 13th gen processors more viable, and the 13600KF is a great choice for the RTX 4070. Before we continue, it's important to know what KF means. The K indicates that this is an unlocked chip, meaning it supports overclocking for even better gaming performance, as for the F, that means it doesn't have any integrated graphics, which is irrelevant since you'll be pairing the CPU with a dedicated GPU like the RTX 4070. The lack of an iGPU also means that it has a cheaper price than the standard version. Compared to its predecessor, the 12600KF, the 13600KF has 8 more efficiency cores, E cores for short, this means that the total core count is 14, compared to the 10 cores on the 12th gen chip. It also has a higher clock speed, more cache, and 4 more threads. These improvements translate to better gaming performance when paired with a powerful GPU like the RTX 4070. The 14 cores in the CPU consist of 6 performance cores, P cores for short, and 8 E cores. P cores are ideal for demanding tasks like gaming, especially when paired with a high-end video card like the RTX 4070. E cores handle background tasks efficiently without compromising gaming performance. This makes the 13600KF a relatively powerful chip for gaming, but also more efficient in less demanding tasks. Despite that, it has a TDP of 125 watts, meaning that at full load, it'll be slightly harder to cool compared to similarly priced Ryzen chips. Circling back to the newer 14600KF, it's surprising to see how much of a better value the older chip is for gamers with an RTX 4070. It's slightly cheaper, has the same amount of cores and threads, and has the same TDP. The only difference is that the 14600KF boosts higher. But that 5.3 GHz clock speed can be achieved with a tiny bit of overclocking on the 13600KF, making it a better value for gamers. Instead of buying the 14600KF, get the 13600KF and a better cooler. This way, you'll get almost the same level of performance for gaming with the RTX 4070, save some money, and enjoy a bit of overclocking for even better performance. Performance-wise, the 13600KF is a great match for the 4070 in both games and productivity. It won't bottleneck the RTX 4070 even at a 1080p resolution, and you can expect high frames in all the latest games. As for productivity apps, it performs a bit better than the Ryzen 5 7600X, it's a great mid-range CPU for editing videos, streaming, and playing games, especially when paired with the RTX 4070. To sum up, what I like is the great multi-core performance, its affordable pricing, it handles both gaming and productivity well, and it supports DDR4 memory. On the downside, it draws quite a lot of power, and it's slightly hard to cool. Ratings? Value for money, 9 out of 10. Gaming performance, 8 out of 10. Productivity performance, 8 out of 10. Efficiency, 7.5 out of 10. Overclocking, 8 out of 10. For an overall rating of 8 out of 10.